What's up hackers? Welcome back to another episode of Hack Crypto, where we hack all of our crypto education. If you guys are brand new here, be sure to be subscribed for my next video. Now in this episode, I'm going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be talking about purely AI because a breakthrough happened this month in October of 2024. Anthropic AI, which is a development company, is really front running the AI movement. And they just released a version 3.5 of Claude, which is an AI, kind of like a chat GPT that you prompt and you talk to, and it does things for you but this takes it to another level. This is effectively a new way to automate white collar jobs, which is alarming to a lot of people. And it's also exciting because it's gonna streamline a lot of mundane tasks like data entry and inventory management and all of these things that we do on a day-to-day -day basis that we can just have Claude do. And I think that this is a breakthrough moment for crypto as well, because I would like Claude to trade some trades for me. I'm not a trader by any means, but I think that Claude is probably better at it already <laughs> than I am. So what I'm gonna do in this video is walk through computer use, which is their new feature that they have just released. And it is in beta, it's very experimental. It's just available to developers via their API. And I saw a demo of this thing and it is really remarkable. It may not seem like it right away, but we're gonna see this thing ramp up very, very quickly. So in this video, I'm gonna talk about a couple different examples of what I believe this is gonna disrupt first for businesses and individuals, because it's kind of eating itself. It's automating the tasks that AI was automating originally for white collar jobs. So I think that this is a really remarkable moment in history where everybody's now saying, okay, AI agents, which are effectively just what they sound like, they're AI agents that do something very specific and they can communicate with each other. This is a moment where they're going to be able to do tasks on your computer for you better than you and faster than you. And I think that that is a, a real leap forward for us as humans. I will be linking Anthropic below their YouTube channel so you guys can check out the demos that they're doing. I highly recommend subscribing to their channel because it is a very important foot race right now taking place between your Googles and your Microsoft doing Copilot and things like that. Everybody is competing and just running as fast as they can to really get the latest and greatest features. And I think that Claude and Anthropic really stand a powerful chance by doing features like this where they're not quite ready for prime time, but they're releasing them. That's always a signal that people are moving extremely fast behind the scenes. So this is Claude 3.5 and computer use has been something people have talked about for a while. And I'm really excited for what this is gonna to do to the entire crypto industry. There is a project right now called Goatsy. And this project was created by an AI agent. It was funded with a grant from Mark Andreessen. And on Twitter, you can see it, it's at Truth Terminal. I'll link to Truth Terminal below, but you can see what it's done, where it's created a meme coin called Goatsy, and effectively it's worth hundreds of millions of dollars in valuation now because it figured out how to send out memes, how to really create the culture around this meme, and people are piling in because they know that an AI agent created this. And it's an incredible moment to watch in the crypto space, watching an AI create this entire token, all the code for it, everything, and have this create hundreds of millions of dollars in value. There's a concept called robotic process automation, also known as RPA. There's a lot of different measurements of this, but effectively what Anthropic is really going after is this multi-billion dollar market, in addition to all the other markets that AI is gonna disrupt. But this specific use of computer use is focused on RPA. And RPA goes across every single industry from retail to manufacturing to healthcare to banking, everything. People are always trying to automate these tasks and now having something that is in order of magnitude cheaper and faster. It's not just about cutting costs, it's literally about speeding things up for humans. This is going to be a very pivotal moment for everybody in business and people that are just trying to remove those mundane sort of data entry focused jobs. And I think that this is gonna get very smart very quickly because people are playing around with it already, teaching it, it's going through and screenshotting your computer, reading all of it on a granular level, analyzing it and making these different entries. So in this demo, what I'm about to show you guys is a form entry where what it's doing is it's taking a screenshot of a bunch of spreadsheets and basically taking the data in that spreadsheet, going onto a website, entering in the form from the data on that spreadsheet and submitting that form. That sounds super basic, but it's important to know that this is entirely an AI doing those tasks, clicking on those tasks on your computer. And it is a big moment for this whole RPA movement, the industry, everything. 
So let's dive onto the Anthropic video that I will be linking below so you guys can check it out. We're gonna be going through a quick demo today. In this fictional demo, a customer, in this case, the Ant Equipment Company, has come to us and asked us to fill out a vendor request form. The data I need to fill out this form is scattered in various places on my computer. What we're gonna do is ask Claude to look at the spreadsheet, check if Ant Equipment is in there, and if not, move over to the CRM and try and find some more information there. Once it has this data, Claude's gonna then fill out the form for us and hopefully transfer the information across to the, the vendor form. The first thing that's gonna happen is Claude's gonna start taking screenshots of my screen and quickly realizes that the Ant Equipment Company isn't actually in the spreadsheet. So the first thing it does is it swaps over to a CRM and searches for the company we're interested in. Luckily, we get a search match and Claude then starts scrolling through the page looking for all the information it needs to fill out this form. Claude then autonomously starts transferring the information across without me having to do anything. And goes through the, the steps and fills out all the information needed. and then submits the form. This example is representative of a lot of drudge work that people have to do. This is available in the API. We're excited for people to try it and we should expect things to get a lot better over the coming months. This is an incredible breakthrough in my opinion in technology and it's just gonna get so much faster at this point with AI agents learning and doing work, talking to each other and doing work together is a big moment for us as humans and in the crypto space specifically, this is gonna change how things work. A little bit scary all at the same time, but I think that it is important to know this isn't about cutting costs, it's not about taking jobs, it is about speeding things up. I believe this is gonna take a traditional entrepreneur that is doing a service-based business and kind of shifting that into something like a prompt engineer, where you're actually getting information from a business owner, telling them these are the prompts that they need to use to automate jobs, tasks, all the different processes that need to be done on a computer. I think that that is gonna be a really big business over the next 10, 20, 30 years. People are gonna be helping businesses automate things and driving those costs down. And everybody that is sort of getting disrupted is gonna shift into helping plug that in to these businesses. So there's gonna be hundreds of thousands of consultants. There's gonna be hundreds of thousands of businesses. It's just gonna create this whole industry of people trying to help push businesses forward with this new technology. So that's it for this video about the RPA kind of industry and Claude. I hope you guys like it. This is different than my traditional videos, but this was just super important and I wanted to share it with everybody because this is a foot race watching Claude and Anthropic really push the boundary here and get this out. Computer use in front of millions and millions of people is truly remarkable to witness and watch as somebody that's been in software for a decade plus, uh, building it, deploying it, getting users, all of that. It's just really cool to watch the real world benefit and how this is going to impact everything directly and how quickly it's happening all at once. And another side note is if you want access to the best models in the entire world, it's 20 bucks a month on ChatGPT on OpenAI, which is an incredible achievement dropping the cost of access to everybody. It's actually free to go on to ChatGPT. Claude is very inexpensive and you can just go on there, subscribe, and you have access to the best technology in the world when it comes to AI, which is a first, I believe. It usually starts at tens of thousands of dollars to get access to things like this, but it is a very cool disruption in terms of access as well. So that is it for this video. Slap a like if you like AI and you want to follow some more videos around the kind of intersection between crypto and AI. I think it's exciting at that intersection. I've done a few videos on it in the past and people really like AI and, and crypto together. They like the two, how they kind of form the future of finance. And that is it for this video. Slap a like. I will see you here on the next episode of Hack Crypto.